we're gonna have a good time today. Let's do this way. Let's do prism, let's do leaf, and then let's drop that legacy. We're gonna have us a great break tonight. Let's bring this light down. Legacy has by far been one of our favorite products. If you did not notice, you should check out the events page as I have already listed our next football break, which is going to be a little bit of a rerun from something we ran a couple of times earlier this year. We're looking at another uh, Panini Classics H2, which provide about 673 numbered cards per box. I don't, I don't think 673 is the actual guarantee, uh, but an absolute ton of numbered cards, some sweet parallels. They've got really nice inserts. So we're gonna we're gonna throw back another one of those while we very very impatiently await the start of the NFL season. Score will drop. You know we'll do score. We do a score box to kick off the football season every year here at Prophecy Box Breaks. I don't see any reason to not continue that tradition this year. So in uh, in true Prophecy Box Break fashion. Welcome to Prophecy Box Breaks for our Thursday evening Team Break event, Team Break Treasure Hunt. I don't know what you want to call it. We're going to rip open these boxes and we're going to find some awesome pieces of cardboard. Thank you so much for being here today. If you're checking out this video down the road, either on our Facebook page, on Twitter, on Reddit, or on YouTube, hey, thanks very much. Do me a favor. If you like what you see, hit that button. You know which one it is. I don't even have to tell you. I'd really appreciate it. The group here really appreciates it. Our ability to get just a teeny tiny bit bigger definitely appreciates it. So thank you very much. Everybody that's here live tonight, I definitely want to give you a special shout out. We had a huge string of these a couple of weeks ago. Ah, we faltered off a little bit, but that's definitely okay. And tonight was our first sellout. Again, before we went live, we sold out hours ago. I'm talking this morning we sold out. I don't know if you saw the close sign go up, but that is definitely something I love to do here. We don't get to do it that often. We had a string of six of them in a row earlier this year. I can't wait to get back to it. eBay kicked us off, told us they didn't want us, replaced us with some goons. That's okay. I'm already exploring other avenues. We've already got our tendrils out there looking for ways that we can expand, looking for ways that we can improve, and looking for new blood to bring into our family. So for the new folks here today, welcome to the group. Everyone here uh, will kindly welcome to you. There are absolutely no douches allowed here at Prophecy Box Breaks, so you don't run into any of that. With that in mind, let's get started. Now, here at Prophecy Box Breaks, everything that we're not currently opening is going to go right back here in the corner. As you'll see, everything was sealed. It's going to be sealed. There's no reason for it to become unsealed. It's just going to sit over there off to the side. We're going to start off with Panini Prism. I'm going to make sure that we've got our list open so that I can congratulate the appropriate people. And and then we are going to start having ourselves a fantastic evening. All right, here we go. Let's do it. Ooh, fancy box with a divider in the middle. You've got six packs to rock here. Panini Prism, four cards per pack. Tennessee Titans on the cover. Let's find out who's inside of pack number one. Good luck, everybody. Pack one, card one, David Montgomery, formerly of the Chicago Bears. Aaron Rodgers, formerly of the Green Bay Packers. We already have a trend. Our first silver prism of the day is Antonio Gibson from the Washington Commanders. Washington today as a special shout out being our first hit of the day. The Commanders held by newcomer Chris Walter. Chris, welcome to the show. Thanks for being part of the crew and I hope you love your first hit of the the uh, the, the career, the process, the party, whatever you want to call it. We have a oh very nice a brilliance Joe Burrow insert. That is gorgeous. All right, let's get these bad boys sleeved up. Everything's just a little off-center. I feel a little weird about it, but that's okay. We'll get through. Pack one, hit one. Maybe two, depending on what you think about Joey B there. Pack number two. 
Man, I'm shaking. I'm so excited for this. I've been looking forward to this rip all week. Two legacy boxes in a row. We have pulled Dare to Tear inserts. Uh, Aaron, I think it was Aaron Rodgers was the first one. No, it was Brett, Brett Favre. Brett Favre was the first one. And then Bo Jackson was the second one. Man, oh man, I'd love to pull a third one this week. I'm just, I'm super excited. I'm shaking a little bit. We're, we're going to get there in due time. We've got Zach Ertz, Cardinals. Allen Robinson, the second, formerly of the Rams. We have a green rookie, Zamir White, for the Las Vegas New Look Raiders. Hardly going to know anybody on that team who isn't named Devontae Adams this year. We'll sleeve that up in a moment. We have our first rookie, Wandale Robinson. Hopefully going to have a little better uh, youthful career with the Giants than Kadaris Tony did as a young wide receiver. Pack number three. Pack number three starts with Legacy Ken Anderson. David Carr from my Houston Texans. Very nice. Not often you pull a David Carr card. Nelson Aguilar, Patriots. And, ooh, very nice. A baby blue rookie card for Jermaine Johnson the second. Wow, I rather thought that the... Uh, that blue parallel would be numbered. Unfortunately, it is not, but that is okay. That is a beautiful card. Nice pull for the New York Football Jets. Today are held by Mr. Gary Beardmore. Gary is responsible for making sure today's break closed out early. Thank you very much, Gary. Congratulations on that pull, brother. Let's find the next one. It's a pretty decent blaster so far, if you ask me. We have Devin Duvernay, Ravens. Marquez Valdez Scantling, Chiefs. We have a green parallel for Quentin Nelson of the Indianapolis Colts. Going to be blocking for Anthony Richardson this year. And a Trent McDuffie rookie card. I wonder what it's like to be a rookie in the NFL. And realize that you just won a Super Bowl. Crazy, crazy, crazy. Two packs to go. Our first sighting of the Dallas Cowboys is Mr. C.D. Lamb. We have Ramondre Stevenson of the New England Patriots. And Jimmy Garoppolo, formerly of the San Francisco 49ers. That's crazy. You said Purdy time, and it was Jimmy Garoppolo. That was that was a little sad. I saw the Niners gold, and I thought you really just hit a home run, man. Coming in the last here, we have Lewis Sign, green parallel rookie for the Minnesota Vikings. That is a pull for Sam Omdahl. Congratulations there, Sam. Nice hit. You got a little fluff on the side here. Let me get that. There we go. We'll sleeve it up. Last pack. I don't know if any of you were here for our NBA Monopoly rip, but our very last pack and the very last card in the pack was an absolutely beautiful money shimmer, LeBron James, valued at over $200 through recent sales on eBay. Absolutely crazy. Alex was stoked to get that card, and I won our bet, which was even better. Micah Hyde comes out of our last pack. We have the stud Ladanian Tomlinson, quite probably the greatest running back of all time. We have a green parallel, Ronnie Lott. That's a second pull for the San Francisco 49ers, if you count that Garoppolo card, I suppose. Beautiful Ronnie Lott, red on green. Today, the 49ers held by Mr. Don Fenton. Congratulations on that pull, Don. Last card in the pack is a rookie George Pickens. Collect those rookie cards. Do not collect those rookie autographs of his. Oh my gosh, those are 
absolutely atrocious. I would actually be disappointed if I pulled one of his rookie cards. So one blaster. We had one, two, three, four green parallels, one silver, one insert, one blue parallel, three beautiful. Uh, actually, and you know, we had three rookie cards up here, so we ended up with six rookies out of the lot. To be honest with you, this is exactly what I look for in blasters and uh, and retail packs is those rookies. So I'm super happy with what we ended up with today. And uh, I'm definitely ready to jump into Leaf. How about you folks? Are you ready? All right. Here we go. In case you were unaware, two autographs plus the 10 card set. Players are going to the teams that drafted them, as was announced way back when the uh, listing went up, and I believe it was Don Fenton had to make sure and ask the million-dollar question. The autographs are right there. We're going to set those right here. We're going to open up the 10-card base set and take a look at that first. And then we'll see who our rookies are. All right, so from the base set, we have... There you go, Don. You called Mr. Purdy time. There he is, Brock Purdy, rocking a yellow border. I assume that's card number one. Yes, it is number one. Card number two, Caleb Williams. Caleb Williams would be considered an NIL. He's going to go into the randomizer. Ooh. Joey B. Bijan Robinson. At the very least, Jasmine, you're walking away with a Leaf rookie card of Bijan Robinson. Yeah, Gary, the the ten card base set should be the same in all of them. It's just a, a difference of the uh, the autographs. Oh, these were green in yours. Was it the? There's a black draft football that I meant to to buy one of them and then realized I don't have any of them now. Uh, I kind of wonder if it's a, a different set, but. We've got Bryce Young, now the starting quarterback of the Carolina Panthers. C.J. Stroud, soon to be rookie of the year and starting quarterback for the playoff bound Houston Texans. Hand in Hooker. Uh, somebody remind me who drafted Hand in Hooker. I thought it was going to be Tennessee, and then I don't believe it was them. Jamir Gibbs, pretty sure he went to Detroit to replace DeAndre Swift, who was traded away in the draft. Oh, Hendon Hooker went to Detroit as well. Okay, so there you go, back-to-back -back rookie cards for Detroit. We have Jackson, Smith, and Jigba. Now, to be honest with you, until Houston traded up for the number three overall pick, I had really, really strongly been pulling for them to draft him at around 12 and um, taking a look, Jackson Smith went 20 overall to the Seattle Seahawks. Is going to be a huge staple in that offense for years to come. Finally, we have Quentin Johnson out of TCU. Quentin Johnson is believed to have a great season. He's in a great opportunity coming into the Chargers. He's got a couple of stud wide receivers in front of him, so he's got the ability to jump into that slot role for now and prove that there's a reason for him to be on that roster. So definitely a nice 10-card base set. Again, we're going to be randomizing the Caleb Williams. We'll do that. Uh, we could probably do that right at the very end of the draft. To come out with our autographs, Trying to figure out how to open it without showing everybody. There we go. Autograph number one is Demario Douglas. And if someone wants to take a look for teams here, they can, or I can do it in a moment. They do come in an oversized top loader. So we have Demario Douglas. We have Deslin Alexander. Douglas's auto was really, really nice. This one was a little scratchy. I don't know about that. 
And our third, oh, is there just two? Oh, there's two. I'm sorry. There's two autos per box. I don't know why I was thinking there was three. So let's take a quick look here. Let me pull up. We'll find out exactly who's got what. Demario Douglas is a wide receiver for the New England Patriots. And Deslin Alexander... Let's see. New York Jets. Uh, he was not drafted. He was signed as an undrafted free agent by the New York Jets on April 29th. That will be a pull for the Jets. It's all right. A little rookie action there. Well, actually, for legacy, we're going to go ahead and pull everything down here and make way for the big guns, make way for our main event tonight. Getting to it a little bit faster than normal just so we can have a little bit more fun along the way. Awesome. Prism Blaster, I'm glad that I've got a couple more of those. Those are gonna be super, super fun to rip. We're gonna leave Caleb Williams up here for the time being so that I don't forget about him. And let's bring on Legacy. I'm going to take a quick sip, and we will get started. Who's everybody looking for tonight, huh? What, what autos are we looking to pull? I want to find us another rookie patch auto like we found in the last Legacy box. It was absolutely amazing. It was probably the best Legacy box I've ever had. LSU just won it with a walk-off two-run homer in the 11th. Nice. Congratulations to LSU, man. All right. Legacy provides so much awesomeness, they can't print it all on the box. <clears throat> I just want to find a third Dare to Tear. I know that's asking for a lot, although we haven't pulled a Lore or a Destiny insert yet. Dare to Tear is definitely where it's at. That's just where it's at. That's, that's definitely it. Uh, we did not tear the last two. Uh, the owners were not interested in tearing, and that is okay. Uh, we made them out to be villains in our Star Wars fun. That is also okay, too. But yeah, we are definitely looking for a dare to tear today. We're going to take a quick look at our packs, see if there's anything that looks crazy fat. This one looks thicker than all of these. We'll put that one on the bottom. This one looks thicker than all of those, so we'll put that one on the bottom. All right. That one looks a little big. That's okay. We're just going to leave that one in there. Welcome to the main event of the evening. We're looking for Waddle. We're looking for Tyla. We're looking for, oh, I know you want to see a Patty Mahomes, Nicobe Dean, pretty much any of those rookie or sophomore Georgia Bulldogs. They're all going to have crazy, amazing careers, and we want copies of all of them. Good luck, everybody. Pack numero uno. Pack number one starts off with Matt Ryan for the Indianapolis Colts. Kirk Cousins. Joe Mixon. Jalen Hurts. Our first legend insert is Shannon Sharp. Rookie, Andrew Booth Jr. for the Minnesota Vikings. And Drake London, first round pick for the Atlanta Falcons. Our first hit of the box, an orange parallel of wide receiver Wandale Robinson for the New York football giants. If you weren't aware, we pull New York giants here at Prophecy Box Breaks. That is what we do, whether you like it or don't like it. Someone was incredibly intelligent enough to scoop up the giants and not let me hold on to them. Now you have this beautiful numbered 75 to 149 orange parallel of Wandale Robinson. 
Very nice, Hollow. Come on, Don. You should know I was going to pull a giant before anything. We're going to put Caleb right over here. We won't forget about him. You should know I'd pull a giant before anything, pal. That's what I do. I don't know how I haven't pulled an Eli Manning autograph yet, but I, I pull everybody else. Every other giant that's out there. Pack number two. We've got Russell Wilson from the Broncos. That is Darius Leonard for the Colts. Scary Terry McLaurin for the Commanders. And some guy that plays quarterback for the Browns. Who's the holder of the Texans today? Let's find out. Dustin Roberts. Dustin, if you are in chat, uh, let me know how badly you want this particular card, okay? Well, we'll put it right over here for you. We've got Keyshawn Johnson is our Legends poll for this pack. Rookies to include... Ouch, I got shot. Brian Robinson Jr., you're good without it, Dustin? Oh, thank goodness. God, I love doing this to his cards. It's just, just trash people belong in the garbage. That's, thank you. Thank you so much. I appreciate you, pal. I feel a little bit better. And actually, actually, I've been waiting for today. Uh, I've been waiting for today because I got one over here, too. Oh, man. Woo. I'll just... Take care of that. We'll put it in the composter. I'll make it into some dirt, and I'll grow something useful from him, okay? There we go. All right. We got Brian Robinson, Jr. We have Jerome Ford. Unfortunately got drafted by the Browns, poor fella. And we have a decade of dominance for the 70s. That is Earl Campbell. As always, polls for the Tennessee, excuse me, for the Houston Oilers are awarded to the Tennessee Titans. That pack feels so thick, I'm going to move it to the bottom. That was the one I kind of questioned before. I said it felt a little thick, but... Man. Thick packs go to the bottom. <laughs> I'm probably wrong. We'll pull it out of this pack or something, but that's okay. All right. With Legacy, you get a couple of minis. I believe we have one here. Uh, the minis can be dangerous. So they can fall out. They can get damaged. We don't want that to happen. We have a mini in this pack, so I'm going to pull it right out. Our first mini... is an orange parallel for the San Francisco 49ers. That is Tyrion Davis Price, rookie from LSU. And is numbered 112 of 125. There you go. Real nice shot right there. There are two autographs per box in Legacy, Gary. Although, in the last Legacy box, we got an autograph, we got Panini points, and we got a Dare to Tear. So again, like I said, that was probably the best Legacy box I've ever opened. Uh, let me grab our mini sleeves here. And we will protect that mini right away. We don't want to risk damage there. You darn tootin' I do. I know I didn't the first couple of boxes... But uh, I realized I wouldn't want to get minis the way that I was sending them out. So we, uh, we take care of our own here at Prophecy Box Breaks. There you are. Pull for the Niners. Shout out to Mr. Don Fantan. Congratulations on that pull, pal. We got two orange pulls. Tell you what, let's put you down here. He's a... Two orange pulls. Now, to come back to our pack here, we have Michael Pittman from the Colts. 
AJ Brown, Titans. Derek Carr, formerly of the Raiders. Legends, what did I tell you? Mr. Eli Manning. Hello, Mr. Manning. Welcome back to Prophecy Box Breaks. I hope you're doing fine today. With three autos and a dare to tear. That's crazy, Ken. I really figured it, it was sad. We when, when we pulled the Panini points, and it wasn't, I think it was like 300 or maybe 400. It wasn't. You know, it wasn't a plethora of points. And then, you know, we got, I think we got an RPA to go along with it. So it was really nice. But the, the dare to tear just blew me away considering that it was a three-hit box. You know that it's super rare to, to get over that average. So it's nice when it does happen. Oh, yeah, definitely not as pretty as your, your jumbo moral. I'm probably going to have to send that card to you separate just so that it's more well protected. I don't want it to get to you and be all bent up. Don, so I very well may just send you a packet with just that that rookie moral in it. Um, I'm going to think on it for a couple of more days, but no worries. Rookies. Malik Willis, rookie quarterback for the Titans. Tyler Beatty, Baltimore Ravens. And... A Generations insert for the Dallas Cowboys. This is Dak Prescott and Troy Aikman. Sleeve up our decade of dominance here. I just realized I forgot to. Did they make a sleeve for the Jumbos? Don, I was unaware of that. I will. I will look into that. Tonight or tomorrow, perhaps I will buy some because more of the. Well, I don't know. I'm not. I so I can buy a twenty pack. That's that's not a problem at all. I'll I'll grab them and I'll make sure and I'll sleeve it up for you, pal. You know I'll take care of you, especially. You know you know I'll take care of you. Pack number four. I think we're at four, right? I lost count with all this talking. I better put my marker up here. Yeah, pack number four. Okay. Pack number four starts off with Chase Young, fifth year option declined by the Commanders. There's actually a lot of rumors about him being traded to the Texans. Yeah, I should know that, Drew. I should know that. I still haven't found a sleeve for that uh, Babe Ruth card that I pulled, so I, I don't know what. I'm going to have to put that in a picture frame or something. We've got Darren Waller, formerly of the Vegas Raiders. Darnell Mooney. Saquon Barkley, New York Giants. Legends is easily one of the best defensive backs of all time. One half of the Barber duo. This is Rondé Barber, primarily with the Tampa Bay Buccaneers. It was easily one of my favorite D-backs to watch. Rookies, we have tight end Trey McBride for the Arizona Cardinals. And quarterback, should be starting quarterback this year, Sam Howell, Washington. Pulling up the rear, we have a timeless talents inserts for Mr. Drew Good. That is D.K. Metcalf. Very nice pull. Always happy to find inserts for my man Drew. And it's been a while since you had the premier hit. Looter has been like, oh man, you're, you're like a magnet for hits, brother. Is he here? Is Ryan not here? Somebody tag him again. Maybe he came in and I missed it, but... I can't believe it. I mean, I, I, mean, I, I can't imagine. We better, we better make it uh, hits only valid if you are present at the time of the poll. And that way, uh, that way Ryan won't hit so much. Let's please not discuss it. <laughs> We've got DJ Moore, formerly of the Carolina Panthers, now the Chicago Bears. Card says Panthers, belongs to the Panthers. Taysom Hill from the Saints. Micah Parsons, Dallas Cowboys. Joey Bosa, our first sighting of the Chargers today. Our legend is one of my favorite running backs of all time, Mr. Ricky Williams. 
Rookies, first off for the Chicago Bears, Kyler Gordon. Ah, okay. Hey, I'm just glad you're here to see the awesome thing that you're going to pull here in a minute. Our second rookie is Tyrion Davis Price from the 49ers. So that's the base rookie that the mini came from, although obviously an orange parallel. And rounding out our pack, oh man, my favorite insert from this set, Time Machines with the greatest quarterback of all time under six feet, Drew Brees. Very nice. Yeah? Hey, thanks very much, Don. Appreciate you, brother. I've been meaning to start a mini Ricky Williams collection. I, uh, I bid on a couple of autographs the other day that were in their last couple of minutes trying to get a steal. And although I was not successful, uh, I, was, I was close. So I know that it's going to be possible. I'm going to be adding some, uh, some Ricky Williams to the collection here in the near future. Pack number six. Hey, hey, what's up, Al? Welcome to the show. Long time no see. We have Javante Williams from the Broncos. Trey Lance. Tyreek Hill. By the way, I have a really nice red parallel Trey Lance autograph for sale. If there's any diehard 49ers fans out there that are interested, just DM me and we can talk. Behind Mr. Tyreek Hill, we have a Jim Kelly Legends insert for the Bills. Our rookies, Matt Coral, guy I thought was going to get to compete for the starting job this year until the Panthers traded up to the first overall pick. And Jalen Tolbert, one of 237 rookie wide receivers from the Dallas Cowboys. Rounding out our pack. Oh, we have two pulls. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. We have a blue Rondé Barber numbered 50 of 50. Book and pull. Let me get it in the light. There you go. 50 of 50. Absolutely beautiful blue Legends parallel. That is the first Legends parallel I've pulled that was not Optichrome. And it couldn't have been of a better guy, man. Rondé Barber, again, loving it. Loving it. We'll sleeve that up in a moment. We also have... Oh, I thought it was a, another parallel. We also have a Decade of Dominance. Brett Favre insert for the Green Bay Packers. Awesome, awesome. Numbered to 50. Very nice. Our lowest pull of the lowest numbered pull of the break so far. Chris is your Niners guy. Good to know, Ryan. Good to know. This pack is a little thick, but we're gonna open it anyway. This is pack seven. Pack seven starts with Josh Allen, our first appearance of the Buffalo Bills. Damian Harris, running back for the Patriots. Zeke Elliott, currently a free agent, but this is a card out to the Cowboys. Chase Claypool, trying to make something happen in Pittsburgh. Up, up, up. Upside down time, we have our legends is Mr. Ed Reed with the Baltimore Ravens, of course. Just for funsies, we're going to pull out this card in the back. That is a Chrome David Bell rookie card. Second appearance of Mr. Bell today. Something nice for the Browns fans out there. Guess what's behind my hand? Guess, guess what's behind Mr. Bell? Anybody? Anybody have a real, a real good, a real awesome guess? Anybody? Come on. Nobody has said this name yet today. We keep overlooking him. It's about time that we pulled something. Don says it's a dare to tear. Don thinks 
that I would pull a dare to tear and then sit here and not show you guys and like bide for time and just fill with random filler. Oh man, I can't believe nobody came up with somebody we I don't think we have ever pulled a hit for this guy. Mr. Oop, oh, oh, there's an Evan Neal rookie card in there I didn't see. Oh, are they they're stuck together. Oh, they're stuck together. Okay, hold on. I thought it was a thick card. It appears to be two rookie cards stuck together. It's Isaiah Spiller. Uh, I thought it was a thick card. Uh, I'm going to try and do my best to separate these very carefully. That's kind of a first for Legacy. We have not had any kind of quality. Oh, there it came. Okay. Looks like they were static cling stuck together, not like anything in the middle. The Isaiah Spiller card is clean. You can get the glare on it. There you go. The back of the Evan Neal card is clean. Uh, I'm sorry I baited you there. I honestly thought that we had a uh, an auto relic there. I, I, I honestly thought that we had a thick card there. Sorry about that, folks. Uh, at least, hey, it's still out there waiting for us. All right. Pack number eight. Come on, pack number eight. Show us a little love. Kyle Hamilton is in the house. Welcome to the show, Kyle. How are you doing today, pal? Kyle is rocking the Giants and the Raiders and doesn't even realize that he's already got a couple of Giants cards. We've got James Conner from the Cardinals. Yeah, I'm sorry, Don. That was a little disappointing to me, too. Xavier Howard from the Dolphins. Jamar Chase, Bengals. Our legend is Steve Atwater, legacy for the Denver Broncos. Kyle, are you at work? Our first Georgia Bulldog of the break, Mr. Trayvon Walker, rocking the Jacksonville logo, but that Georgia Bulldog uniform, baby, gotta love it. John Mechie the third, looking to make an impact with the Houston Texans this year is your second rookie. And bringing up the rear, oh, see, there, you got to watch out for those. Thankfully, it fell onto our protective cover. We have James Conner. This is a bronze parallel of Mr. James Conner of our mini category. And it's the only thing I don't like about Legacy. I honestly wish that the minis were in a mini pack. Just to stop from that happening. We have had unfortunate incidents with it before. As you can see, card looks to be in excellent condition. That's why we use the protective cover. Your Mr. James Connor, if I can get a good look on the camera, is number 29 of 75, making it our second lowest numbered hit of the break pull for the Arizona Cardinals. Today, the Cardinals held by Mr. Gary Beardmore. Once again, Gary picking up the Cardinals scooping today. Wanted to make sure that we were sold out for today's break, and that karma is coming right back at you. Thank you so much for scooping, Gary. Congratulations on that pull. The rear of the pack brought us a Cooper Cup for the Ages insert. This is our first for the Ages insert of the break. Pack number nine. Pack number nine starts off with Jonathan Taylor, star running back of the Indianapolis Colts. Derrick Henry, say the exact same thing, but of the Tennessee Titans. Aaron Donald, defensive tackle, Rams. Our legend is a guy I'm not super proud of either, Mr. Mike Vick. Can't disagree that he was an absolutely electric player who was years ahead of his time in the NFL. Rookie, second Georgia Bulldog of the break, Mr. Jordan Davis. This one going out to the Philadelphia Eagles and Mr. Ken Collins. 
And star wide receiver of the New Orleans Saints, Chris Olave. Finishing off our pack here, we have, oh, very nice, a green parallel front numbered Marquise Brown for the Baltimore Ravens. If we can get a good shot, that is numbered 96 of 100. There it is. Pull for the Baltimore Ravens. Gary. Gary, that karma is coming back threefold, brother. Congratulations. Your third pull. Behind Marquise, we have a timeless talents bus. Jerome Bettis. Pittsburgh Steelers. Failing to find them on the list here for some reason. Steelers held by Mr. Eric Pena. Pack number 10. For those of you that were unaware, Prophecy Box Breaks not only operates here on Facebook. However, we also operate a subreddit. There's a Twitter account and a YouTube channel. And we definitely appreciate your membership in any of those. Trevor Lawrence for the Jacksonville Jaguars. Antonio Gibson, Washington Commanders. Josh Jacobs, Las Vegas Raiders. Our legend... The second coming of Mr. Bo Jackson showed up two weeks ago in the form of a dare to tear card. Mr. Kyle Hamilton, did you decide whether or not you were going to dare to tear that card? Or is it going to go directly into your collection, pal? Let us know what you decided to do. We've got Sauce Ahmad Gardner, Defensive Rookie of the Year for the New York Jets. Beautiful rookie card. Behind him... Jameson, I'm not sure whether or not I should place this bet, Williams. Uh-oh. You know what that means, folks. You know what that means. Behind the card that's behind Jameson Williams is our second time machine of the day, this one, number 12, Aaron Rodgers, Green Bay Packers. Let's sleeve that up. We have a 2022 Panini Legacy Rookie Premium. Ah, oh, penmanship silver. It's George Pickens. <coughs> I specifically said not to pull a George Pickens autograph because it's a squiggly line and it is an embarrassment of an autograph. Uh, special congratulations go out to the holder of the Steelers, Mr. Eric Pena. Uh, typically, I would say congratulations on that pull. In this case, I would say I hope you can sell your redemption. Uh, I think you would enjoy... A different card from your collection than the squiggle of a line that Pickens calls an autograph. Uh, however, to each their own, congratulations on your redemption pull. Hopefully Pickens gets those autographs out to you quickly. Uh, if you can't tell, I'm a little disappointed that we pulled a George Pickens autograph after I said that we should shy away from pulling a George Pickens autograph. Let's take a let's take a sip of water and uh, and uh, and collect ourselves for just a moment. Have a, a moment of silence for the uh, the hit that could have been. Okay, that's enough. Let's move on. Pack number uh, eleven, I believe. Pack number 11 feels like, man, I, I called that bottom pack a fatty, fatty boom -baladdy. This one really feels fat. We got Matt Judon from the Patriots. 
He was a Georgia Bulldog, yeah, but his mama didn't teach him to sign his name and neither did the University of Georgia. So, you know. Yeah, yeah, there there have been some really poor autographs this year. I wish that's something that they would bring up in the Rookie Symposium. You know, if you're going to take the money to sign these autographs and to put your your name out there like that, like I, I, I kind of just crapped on you because of the way that you sign your name. Not because of the kind of person you are, whether or not you're a good football player, you know, whether you open the door for somebody. None of that mattered to me. All that mattered was your autograph. And, and yeah, that, that's not the greatest either. But let's, let's all try and do a little better moving forward. We have C.D. Lamb. T.J. Watt. We have a Legends insert for Amon Green of the Green Bay Packers. We have a rookie, New York Giants first round pick, Kayvon Thibodeau. Because we pulled Giants here, if I haven't said that before. And Devin Lloyd, uh, excuse me, not running back, linebacker for the Jaguars. Closing out this pack, we have a red parallel of rookie Romeo Dobbs, wide receiver for the Green Bay Packers, numbered 121 of 299. And our third time machine, third quarterback, that is John Elway. Very nice. Love, love, love this insert. Tell you what, as our shortest number so far, let's pull you up here. For the time being, well, well, let's do this. We'll do this here. We got two autograph spots up front here. If anyone was wondering why I haven't filled those in yet, all right. So now we're getting into the thick packs. We're gonna do like this. I think we're just gonna we're gonna open them like that. Here we go, folks. I guess, I mean, I guess the redemption should be up here for calling it, you know, it's an autograph. I suppose it's an autograph. By definition, it's an autograph, although it's more like, okay, I'm going to need you to initial in this 937 places, so get ready for that. Pack 12. Pack 12 starts off with Patty Mahomes. DeAndre Hopkins, still looking for a team. Jalen Waddle of the Dolphins. Our Legends pull today is Mr. Brett Favre. Rookies. That is Mr. Kyle Hamilton for the Baltimore Ravens. Not to be confused with Kyle Hamilton of Prophecy Box Breaks. James Cook, running back, Buffalo Bills, Georgia Bulldog. And an orange parallel. Oh, man. Ken, orange parallel. Jordan Davis, rookie card, 93 of 199. Very nice, brother. You called it early on. You said you were looking for Georgia Bulldogs, and Legacy has not disappointed. Behind Mr. Jordan Davis, we have a Timeless Talents, Christian McCaffrey. Poor holder for the Carolina Panthers, knowing this is the last year they're going to see McCaffrey pulls. go. We got four packs to go. Still looking for our dare to tear. It just means I did a better job of moving it to the back than last time. We got David Montgomery, formerly of the Bears. 
Danny Dimes, New York Giants. Whoops, sorry, put a legend card in the wrong spot here. There we go. Jerry Judy, wide receiver, Denver Broncos. Tyler Lockett, Seahawks. Legends card, Luke Cacelli. Our rookies are Isaiah Likely, Baltimore Ravens. And quarterback Desmond Ritter, who looks to be starting for the Atlanta Falcons this year. Followed by an under-the-lights Optichrome Malik Willis rookie card rocking that Liberty U uniform. Very nice insert hit for the Tennessee Titans. Three packs to go. Let's put this one on the bottom, shall we? Three packs to go. We have Justin Fields from the Chicago Bears. A lot of speculation about them moving him in the offseason and during the draft, but nothing happened in there. Cameron Jordan from the Saints. Cortland Sutton, wide receiver, Broncos. DK Metcalf making his second appearance of the break. Legends, we have Nick Mangold for the New York Jets. Rookies are Kyron Williams from the Rams. Looking to steal some of those carries from Cam Akers. And Jermaine Johnson, the second of the New York Jets. And in the back, we have our Optichrome under the lights, Kyler Murray. So I think I called this Optichrome. These were our silver. The under the lights is our Optichrome parallel, as you can see. Kyler Murray had a disastrous season last year and now has lost his biggest weapon. So when he comes back, I don't really know who he's going to be throwing the ball to, but Arizona's probably going to be in the hurt bag for wins for a couple of years. Both of these, now I've, I've seen that there's something in there. This one feels like there's something in here. Oh my God, we got... Oh... Oh, we got two hits. Oh, my God. If we hit an autograph and a Dare to Tear card, my brains are going to explode all over this room, and I'm going to need a cleanup, okay? So if, if we drop this, somebody, somebody, you know, call my house. Uh, our redemption is George Pickens for the Pittsburgh Steelers was a hit for Mr. Eric Pena. Uh, I haven't seen Eric. Do me a favor and somebody tag him for me. All right, everybody. All right, all right, all right. Oh, man, I'm excited. I'm so excited. I'm so excited. Come on, tell me we got a third dare to tear. Tell me we got three case hits in a row. I'm so excited. I don't know which pack to open. We're going to open this one first. Oh, okay. I'm all shaky. Okay, here we go. Oh, man. Oh, baby. We got DeAndre Swift, formerly of the Lions. Debo Samuel, star wide receiver, San Francisco 49ers. Travis Kelsey, Kansas City Chiefs. Legend. Very nice. Ken Houston of the Houston Oilers. Drake Jackson, defensive lineman for the San Francisco 49ers, rookie from last year's draft. Our second rookie is none other than Georgia Bulldogs' own George, I don't know how to sign my name, Pickens. And finally, we're going to take this card from the back. 
Another time machine. Our first non-quarterback is Demarcus Ware of the Dallas Cowboys. Should I be like whatnot and pretend like there's no other card back there? Just kidding, folks. There's no scams here. Congratulations are about to go out to somebody for this absolutely beautiful Dare to Tear. Troy Palmalu. Three legacy boxes. Three case hits, because that's how we do it here at Prophecy Box Breaks. Panini Legacy has been our best product, hands down, three years running. I will come back to it as long as it's in existence. Please, oh please, when Fanatics takes over, somehow let me continue to be able to rip this product. Pittsburgh Steelers, Troy Palmalu, dare to tear. <sighs> Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Wow. Wow. Did 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 nobody nobody tag him? I'll tag him. I'll tag him. It's okay, I got you. Oh man. Last pack. We got a big old diamond in the rough waiting for us here. No more hesitation. Thank you so much for being with us this week. Our next NFL break will be in two weeks' time, and we'll be headlining Classics H2 Football. Tons of treasures. An absolutely great time. I hope you're there with us. Our last pack kicks off with James Robinson. Kyler Murray. Stefan Diggs. Legends, Eddie George, our third hit today for the Houston Oilers. Our rookies, oh, I put the legend card in the wrong spot again. Our rookies are Traylon Burks from the Tennessee Titans. And Kobe Bryant of the Seattle Seahawks. Technically, the last card of the pack is a For the Ages Flipper Anderson. Wow! 100% guarantee that is the first appearance of Flipper Anderson here at Prophecy Box Breaks. Very nice pull. That is a beautiful one for the collection. I don't care if it's a base insert. That's definitely one for the collection. Nice pull. We'll sleeve that up momentarily. Now is the time we've all been waiting for. Our biggest, possibly our biggest hit of the day, although that Troy Palmalu is going to be hard to beat. Boys and girls, ladies and gentlemen, children of all ages, this is wide receiver Alec Pierce. Rookie, patch, auto for the Indianapolis Colts. Not a team that you see hitting very often. These futures inserts are absolutely amazing. This particular one, numbered 95 of 99 as a bronze parallel. The Indianapolis Colts belong to Mr. Gary Ambrose. I don't believe I saw Gary in the chat. Gary, this is his first time with Prophecy Box Breaks, his cherry popping so to speak and brother you hit an absolute gem thank you so much for being here tonight everybody thank you so much for being part of the prophecy box breaks family unfortunately eric pena is not here for me to ask for his permission to rip that dare to tear card as you know we do not rip without permission so the only thing that we got to do left tonight is going to be to randomize this caleb williams now if Eric messages me, or you know, I'm going to reach out to him. If he says, heck yeah, go ahead and rip that card, then we're going to do a video. We're going to... Oh, Gary! Gary, you're here! Brother! Brother, you hit a banger! You hit an absolute home run! Rookie Patch Auto, Alec Pierce. I hadn't, I, hadn't, I hadn't seen your name in chat. I didn't think that you were here. Congratulations on your pull. We've got a randomizer to do real quick. We've got this Caleb Williams rookie card. We're going to open up random.org as we do it here and run a line real, real quick. Next week's 
uh, Topps 2023 Series 2 Jumbo still has spots available. So don't hesitate. Grab yours while you can. You do not want to miss out. Because all teams sold today and none of them are held by me, all teams will go into the randomizer. I'm setting the randomizer up as we speak. As is a tradition, we will randomize four times. The name that is on the top of the randomizer will find themselves in possession of a handy dandy Caleb Williams Leaf rookie card. One, two, three, and the holder of Caleb Williams today is the New York Giants because why not? Because why not? That's what we do here. We pull dare to tear and we pull the New York Giants. Congratulations to everybody that had amazing hits. Jasmine, I'm glad that we at least found you a Bijan rookie card to start off your collection. Jasmine actually went to the same high school as Bijan Robinson, so uh, a little bit of an extra little slice of pie there. We found so much awesomeness today, I can barely fit it in. Be on the lookout for that post of all of our wonderful hits for today. Thank you one last time for being part of the Prophecy Box Breaks family, and I cannot wait for next Thursday. I will see you there.